Greetings, Rams fans. Today we're about to embark on an exciting journey into the heart of the Los Angeles Rams offseason strategy. You're in for a treat as we unveil some insider insights sourced from the most reliable outlets. So get comfortable and brace yourselves for some game-changing revelations. But before we dive into the nitty-gritty, a quick shout-out to all you die-hard Rams supporters who've been standing by the team for over a decade. Your unwavering loyalty is the lifeblood of this community. If you're part of the faithful crew and haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and join us for all the latest Rams updates delivered straight to your screen. Ladies and gentlemen, Rams faithful gather round as we delve into the latest buzz surrounding the Los Angeles Rams offseason plans. Aaron Schatz, the reputable voice of ESPN, has shed light on what could be the team's top priority in free agency securing a center. Specifically, Schatz advocates for the Rams to set their sights on Andre James. James, a UCLA Bruin standing at an imposing 6 feet 4 inches and weighing in at 300 pounds, emerged from humble beginnings as an undrafted free agent signed by the Oakland Raiders back in 2019. Despite initially seeing limited playing time in his first two seasons, James eventually rose to prominence, earning himself a starting role. Since then, he's quietly become one of the NFL's most underrated centers. Now, let's talk numbers. James recently inked a lucrative two-year deal worth a staggering $8.7 million. That's a hefty sum, especially when compared to the projected market value of the Rams' current starting center, Coleman Shelton pegged at $4.3 million by over the cap. But here's where the plot thickens. When it comes to pass blocking, James brings a significant upgrade over Shelton. In the last season, James ranked second among all centers in pass blocking win rate, an impressive 9.6.5. According to Pro Football Focus, he allowed a mere 19 pressures throughout the season, landing him in the sixth spot league wide. In contrast, Shelton struggled, conceding a whopping 36 pressures, including a concerning seven in week two against the San Francisco 49 ears, earning him the unenviable second highest spot in the league. However, Shelton's forte lies in run blocking. With Shelton anchoring the line, running back Kieran Williams led the league in yards before contact, averaging an impressive 5.1 yards per carry when running through Shelton's gaps. While Shelton undoubtedly benefited from having top-tier guards flanking him, his contribution to Williams' success cannot be overstated. Moreover, there's the age factor to consider. James will be entering the 2024 season at the ripe age of 27, while Shelton will be 29. Though the numbers may seem to favor Shelton, the decision ultimately hinges on the Rams' assessment of their current situation. With the demand for quality centers soaring in this offseason, Shelton's contract value could skyrocket. The Rams must weigh their options carefully, considering the possibility that Shelton could improve as a pass blocker and remain healthy well into his 30s. It's a calculated gamble, given that Shelton's first season as a starting center was just last year and only his second as a starter overall. So Rams fans, the million-dollar question remains, is Andre James worth the investment? Or should the Rams stick with Coleman Shelton? It's a decision that could shape the team's trajectory for seasons to come. Stay tuned as we keep you updated on all the developments surrounding this intriguing offseason saga. Now, here's where your voice matters, Rams faithful. What's your take on the potential addition of Andre James to our roster? Do you believe he's the missing piece to our offensive puzzle, or do you have reservations? We want to hear your thoughts, so drop them in the comments below and let's spark a lively conversation. Before we wrap up, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up to show your support for the Rams. And to all our dedicated viewers, stay tuned because we've got plenty more exclusive updates headed your way. Until next time, keep the Rams spirit alive and keep rooting for the horns.